Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. Recent remarks by General Brian Fenton, head of US Special Operations Command, have shed light on the involvement of UK Special Forces in Ukraine, igniting discussions about Western military engagement in the region. In an interview with the Associated Press on May 12, 2024, General Fenton discussed the valuable lessons gleaned from the experiences of British counterparts operating in Ukraine, hinting at the adaptation of U.S. Green Beret teams based on these insights. General Fenton emphasized the importance of integrating additional expertise into special operations teams, citing examples such as cyber experts, air force pilots, and cryptologists, drawn from strategies observed in U.K. special forces operations in Ukraine. These modifications, he noted, are directly informed by lessons learned from British partners, who have swiftly adapted to include broader joint force support roles. The UK Ministry of Defence has chosen not to comment on General Fenton's observations, maintaining its consistent policy of not discussing UK Special Forces operations. However, reports dating back to April 2022 from the Times of London and confirmed by senior European defence officials have hinted at the presence of UK Special Forces in Ukraine, primarily focused on training Ukrainian recruits and providing strategic guidance on anti-tank missile systems. General Fenton's remarks come amid growing speculation about the covert operations of Western military units in Ukraine and the potential for increased overt engagement. French President Emmanuel Macron's openness to deploying French troops under certain conditions has added fuel to these discussions, prompting strong reactions from Russia, including threats of nuclear retaliation against NATO countries intervening in Ukraine. The challenges faced by U.S. Special Operations commanders extend beyond operational considerations. General Fenton highlighted the need to manage budget cuts while incorporating more high-tech experts into special operations teams. The U.S. Army Special Forces, facing a reduction of about 5,000 troops over the next five years, are contemplating adjustments to Green Beret teams to accommodate specialized technical skills amidst evolving military requirements. As debates surrounding Western military involvement in Ukraine persist, General Fenton's remarks underscore the complexities of modern warfare and the imperative for adaptive strategies informed by international partnerships and shared operational experiences. That's all for now, see you later.